Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Riverlore, and welcome to Icarus. Well, what a serendipitous day, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the 30th episode, the recording of the 30th episode. Uh, I'm proud of myself for actually following through on this you know a lot of people when i i get the impression that when they start down this journey and they don't have hundreds and hundreds of subscribers right away um then uh you know they may quit <laughs> they may you know they may uh, give up and uh we've just been making a steady steady progress so i want to i want to uh, welcome crumpets 89 love crumpets by the way um great pastry uh and he just so happens to be our 30th subscriber and i'm recording my 30th episode so uh it seems pretty serendipitous uh i also want to thank let me see do to do one second i want to thank rod knob so Rod Knob uh, actually came up with a good piece of information that I didn't realize you could even do, but apparently you can use your scythe on your boxes, and so you get more yield. So that's uh, that's good. I was under the impression I was worried that maybe two boxes wouldn't be enough uh, as far as yield goes, but. Um, I mean, that's 22 mushrooms in the short time that I was there, and 24 pumpkins. Uh, so, yeah, we have more than enough mushroom pumpkins, uh, considering that we eat a, a new piece of meat pie every now and then. Um, one of the other things that uh, Rod Knob reminded me of is that I need to go and get a polar bear head. So, we're going to... I'm actually going to go, for some of you who have been watching me, that's what we're doing. We're going to go on a polar bear hunt. Um, I've got lots of healing potions. I've got, well, 57 arrows just actually may not be enough. So let's go over here. I need to make another eight stacks because there is... They're not made here. Maybe they're made on the end or on the. Maybe they're made over here. Bada bing. So. I need eight copper parks. I can't believe how inexpensive these are to make compared to when I first started playing this game. They've definitely changed the recipe. So let's just grab a stack of 20. Okay, and let's make eight of these, and then that is going to make that gives us 97. Okay, we are now going to go and see if we can find us a polar bear. If any of you have uh, played this game a lot and fought polar bears with a bow and can recommend a strategy, uh, I'd really appreciate it. Because I remember when I first started fighting grizzly bears it, before I learned the Olay, and it was basically hell on earth. Uh, it was brutal. So, this is really strange. I went and started a f a fooling around with my settings. And uh, I am getting some higher frame rates, so I'm in the 40s uh, rather than the low 30s. But it's really strange because... Oh, no. Let's get back to where we're not going out. If you take a look at the top right... Oh! This is a different zone. So... This is going to be a really big, ugly storm. Temperature is dropping rapidly. 
But if I go into the next zone... Alright, well... I think this guy's trying to attack me, but I think he might be... stuck? Come right here, Snow Leopard. So let's, uh, damn it, I thought I was going to be so impressive. Just charging out, going to get a polar bear right off to get gold, but it appears. I want to go and see my resolution here. Oh, we're still 2560. Okay, great. Um, so it's a beautiful sunny day here. It is storming to beat the band out there. So we are going to... Let's see if we can make something from the new tier. So yeah, I did. I did turn some of the graphics down. Uh, I still think it looks freaking gorgeous, but in order to get the better performance, and it's not anywhere near. I'm not getting any tearing now. Uh, or uh, or shutter or anything else like that. So let us go into the tech tree. We have lots of points. We don't even have the fabricator yet. So let's learn the fabricator. We're going to need that for sure. A landmine? <laughs> what? 500 damage, pure 500 points, pure damage. Wow. That is crazy, eh? Let's take a look at what's available in tier 3 at least. Oh, I know what we're going to do. We're going to make a second mine. So first of all, let's grab... One, two, three, four, five, twenty-five of these. And let's build one of these. Yeah. And then come over here. Uh Chromax. Yep. And then let's go out here. Put the second cannon. There we go. La 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 la. All right, we need. I think. Oh, sorry, I got an itch. We need. Uh, 10 electronics so 10 electronics is uh, 50 gold wire so 10 of these do we have any gold wire already no we don't craft and then organic resin and i think organic resin is made with oxite and okay we have some organic resin here let's just go ahead and pop that over here there we go and can i make 10. nope i can't oh i need more copper wire 30 more copper wire hmm Okay, 
So we got the electronics. We need 50 copper wire. So we need 10 of these. And then we need 12 steel ingots. Take this. I don't think that we have found a copper, but I did find that aluminum. But I have, like, look at all the aluminum I have. Like, that's a lot of aluminum. Let me pull up a map um, of here, and then we're gonna pull. Let me try and find the deep mine. Okay, there we go. So that one is iron. So just in case any of you are wondering what I'm doing, I'm actually on uh, IcarusIntel.com's website. Uh, they have um, an excellent map uh, tool there um, that, um, that shows us where all of the uh, uh, mines are and so on and so forth. It's incredibly helpful. We're gonna get, I did not get another fuel tank. So we're going to carry this on us since we're going someplace where it's chilly. Let's go ahead and take that. Let's go over there. All right, that storm should be over now. We're not going to fight that wolf. We're just going to outrun him. try and find ourselves a polar bear and I think because when we're in the cold region I think we totally will that's what I think This doesn't look like ice. Clearly this is a mine. And I think that there is a Right along here, a little deposit. All right, I think that we have enough aluminum. I want to go see. There is another one along the along the wall here. Hmm, I'm noticing some. Like the woolly zebras aren't even woolly anymore. I went in and I got the game. I did the game's like recommended settings and then I thought it was too low. Where am I here? There it is right there. Oh, no. Uh, coal, I don't need coal. Am 
Now we're gonna try and find a polar bear. All right, let's go look at this place, shall we? Well, this is definitely a deep cave, but I think this is supposed to be a mine, but I'm not seeing any mine nodes, are you guys? Hmm. the heck is going on here? Alright. Oh, I see. I didn't turn it on. Where are the mines? Very, very strange. Very strange indeed. Well, I'm at 50, between 40 and 60 frames per second, so I mean, the performance is definitely there, but I guess you sacrifice some, some video quality, like those zebras, those uh, woolly zebras don't look anything like the normal woolly zebras, and even the, um, even the deep mines don't look like they normally would. The I can pick some snow. No? What was too hard? Hmm. Gotta be a polar bear around here, man. What the deuce? <coughs> Exceptionally cool. Well, if we run into a polar bear now, we're kind of pooched, man. Like, this is not going to be good at all.
one of these days, guys. I'm gonna remember to bring my shit. What a knucklehead I am. When you go into the forest by or the ice by ice biome, you need to bring ladders be or ramps because I'm telling you flat out there are some deep crevices and things like that. Okay, that's a bunny. What is it? Is it gold? Is it copper? Ha ha! That's what I want. We are certainly running low. Well. Now, what I should be doing is I should be making markers that I can put down, but I think I'm pretty straight where I am. So like I have one here and then one all the way down. That's good enough to get us started. What time of day is it? 1300? I'm not seeing any polar bears. I think it specifically happened because oh, yeah. Too much trouble. I think, ladies and gentlemen, that there is a knot. A Not any polar bears here. There is not any polar bears here. So I think we actually, I apologize for there not being any action. Uh, but I think what we might have to do is actually go back to... Oh, look at how much forest is there. Maybe in where that forest is. Sorry, shaggy zebras that aren't shaggy. I mean, if you guys take a look at my struggles that I've had in the past with, uh, with frame rates, and I'm sitting at like 40, 50, rather than, you know, 25, 30... Can I do it? Oh, <laughs> that was a jump and a half. Holy. I am digging these forests, this forest. That's a wolf. I wonder.
Nope. No, no, no. Another zebra. Another wolf. Can't get me up here. Look at that place. That is just freaking gorgeous. You know what? I think you guys know what time it is. I think it's time to get a snapperoo. All right. Even with my video settings like look at my shadows just poop I really need to upgrade that card but it is going to have to wait a little while I think we're going down and if we have to we will build a shit shack really quickly to stay the night the heck are we? We're all the way over there. We are nowhere near where I thought we were going to be. I think we need to take more quests, as silly as that sound guy, sounds, guys. Because that's the only reason there was polar bears before. So far, at half hour long, unsuccessful polar bear hunt. But, I mean, we did get another drill created, right? We put it on the copper. Because we're going to start be starting to do a lot of electrical stuff here pretty quick. I've been putting it off and putting it off, but I guess... I guess we're going to have to make that work. What is the temperature? Okay, so we're back in the, the warm zone. The warm winter zone. Sorry for that, ladies and gentlemen. Had a little bit of an itch. What is that? A snow stalker? What the deuce is that? What the hell? What is a snow stalker? Help. Help me.
Where is it? Oh, hey, where's my healing potion? Drake, 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 Drake. the deuce I need to calm down man holy Hannah that is terrifying ladies and gentlemen oh we're gonna get it wow man That is some kind of frightening. Uh, okay, where are we here? So we're gonna need this, this, and this. We're gonna bring some wood with us. We're gonna bring a shit shack because we're gonna need it. Uh, so we're gonna need a fireplace. One, two, we only need two of those. We need one, two, three, four. We're gonna need one of those. Sort. Uh, okay. Now we're gonna make. I don't have water. What do I need to make this meat pie? Okay, I need two, two mushrooms, two pumpkin. One, two, boom. One, two, boom. Uh huh, uh huh. Craft max two. Let's get our other set of armor, minus the headpiece, obviously. So we're not going out there completely naked. Let's get an oxygen tank. And I guess maybe a spare water bottle. So I need one cured leather and eight iron ignit ingots. Let's bring all of this into here. So that means I'm going to need 20, one, two, three, four. Uh, eight of these. Um, <clears throat> well, I've never seen one of those before in my entire life, and uh, clearly its head is not its crit point. Really curious to see what its critical hit point is. Oh, what's this? A second food buff, so that's good. Let's put this over here. We're going to need to bring water with us. Uh, activate. And uh, that's okay anyways, because um, I need, like for instance, what I'm making here, I need water. So I can just leave that in there. It's exactly why I keep extra stuff. As a matter of fact, knowing, you know, I might have to go through and actually start making some second bow and 
so on and so forth. shit alone. Jerk. All right, ladies and gentlemen. I think we are going to call the episode right now. It's not a very happy episode. It's not a very cheery episode. We failed in every single way that we possibly could. Um, we died. We didn't find a polar bear. And uh, I have vengeance in my heart. So, that being said... <laughs> First of all, let me thank uh, let me thank Crumpets uh, eighty nine for getting us to thirty subscribers. Good on you, my my uh, my newfound friend. Um, thank you very much for all of the comments uh, and support and stuff like that. Uh, again, greatly appreciated. Rod Knob, uh, excellent advice on using my scythe on collecting from my garden boxes. Appreciate that a lot. Um, as I always say. Um, if, uh, if you like the episode, go ahead and smash that, uh, or hit that like button. Uh, if you want to, uh, continue to be notified when we come out with new content, please smash the notification button. And if you think that I've earned it and you're excited about seeing where the journey goes and you want to support me the best way you can right now, um, please go ahead and subscribe or recommend me to friends and maybe hopefully they'll subscribe as well. As always, wherever you happen to be in the world, whether it's morning, afternoon, or evening, I hope that you've had an amazing day. I hope in some small way I was able to make it better and maybe I put a smile on your face. And, um, and I guess we'll see you next episode. So thank you very much and goodbye.